subscribe the channel prostech and press the bell icon to get latest technology videos once we release more importantly the subscription to the channel is completely free friends nowadays smartphones are the need of everyone and if you want to upgrade your smartphone to some other phone then this video would help you decide what to buy and what not therefore to get this useful information watch this video completely till the end because i am going to share all info with you so you are at right place welcome friends you are watching prostech so let's get started friends so starting with the honor 10 device it runs android 8.1 oreo and powered by high silicon kernel 970 processor with 2.4 and 1.8 gigahertz octa core with gpu mali g72 mp12 whereas samsung galaxy s9 it runs android 8.0 oreo powered by 2.8 gigahertz octa core processor exynos 9810 octa or qualcomm snapdragon 845 chipset and with Mali G71 MP18 or Adreno 630 GPU depends on the region where it is launched. Moving on to display, then Honor 10 is 5.84 inches device with IPS LCD display having resolution 2280 by 1080 pixels and with 432 ppi pixels density. It comes with front, back glass and aluminum frame and EMUI 8.1 user interface as well. Whereas Samsung Galaxy S9 is 5.8 inches device with Super AMOLED display having resolution 2960 by 1440 pixels with 570 ppi pixels density. Friends, moreover, Galaxy S9 comes with front and back Corning Gorilla Glass 5 with aluminium frame, Samsung Pay and 3D home button. This phone is IP68 certified, dust or waterproof over 1.5 meters and with 30 minutes. Talking about the internal memory then Honor 10 is available in two variants one is 64 GB and 128 GB with 4 GB RAM and other is 64 GB with 6 GB RAM but there is no micro SD support friends as far as concerned about colors for this device then it is produced in Mirage purple Mirage blue Magic Knight black and gray gal colors Moving on to Galaxy S9 here you can choose internal memory between 64 GB or 256 GB of storage with 4 GB RAM internal memory can be expandable via external micro SD up to 400 GB that uses SIM2 slot friends you can enjoy this phone in various colors like midnight black coral blue titanium gray and lilac purple If we talk about the dimension of Honor 10, it measures 149.6 by 71.2 by 7.7 mm of height, width, thickness, and 153 grams of weight with dual nano SIM option. Whereas dimension of Galaxy S9, it measures 148 by 69 by 8.5 mm thick smartphone weighing 163 grams with front and back Corning Gorilla Glass 5 skin protection and with hybrid dual Nano SIM standby options. About the camera, then Honor 10 comes with dual 16 megapixels with 1.8 aperture plus 24 megapixels primary cameras with face detection, auto focus, and LED flash. You will also have geo tagging, touch focus, HDR, and panorama modes as well. You can also be having different shooting modes with 1080p and 2160p at 30 frames per seconds and also equipped with 24 megapixels front camera for taking selfie with 2.0 aperture and 1080p recording. Coming to primary camera of Galaxy S9, it comes with 12 megapixels with 1.5 aperture face detection autofocus object image stabilization with LED flash. You can also find the geo tagging simultaneous 4K video and 9 megapixels image recording touch focus face detection auto HDR with panorama mode. Friends you can find different video shooting modes in this device that can shoot videos of 2160p at 60 frames per seconds, 1080p at 240 frames per seconds, 720p at 960 frames per seconds with HDR and dual video recording. Moreover as far as concerned about secondary camera then this Smartphone comes with 8 megapixels front camera with 1.7 aperture, auto focus, 
1440 pixels at 30 frames per second, a dual video call with auto HDR. Friends, in Honor 10, fingerprint scanner is placed on the front panel of the phone. It also comes with different sensors like accelerometer, proximity and gyro sensors with campus. This phone also comes with Wi-Fi, dual band, Wi-Fi direct, hotspot, Bluetooth, GPS, NFC, infrared port, fast battery charging with 5 volts and 4.5 amperes dash charger, type C reversible connector and USB on the go. This phone is also powered by 3400 mAh non-removable battery as well. Whereas Samsung Galaxy S9 comes with different sensors like fingerprint sensor mounted on the rear side of the phone, repositioned just below primary camera, also having iris scanner, accelerometer, barometer, gyro proximity and heat rate. This phone is also having Wi-Fi dual band, Wi-Fi direct, hotspot, Bluetooth, GPS, NFC, Bixby, Samsung DeX, Fast battery charging with quick charge 2.0, Type-C reversible connector and powered by 3000 mAh non-removable battery as well. So that was the quick comparison of both smartphones. You can also check further details in the description below. What do you think about these smartphones? Do let us know in the comments section below. I hope you liked this video and don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching.